we do not want to take $90 billion from the reserves to prop up large thematic link companies or MNCs. Rather, we propose using a larger proportion of the NIRC to put the money back into the hands of the people. Jise is our economics guru, and let me quote him on that. He says, the investment returns from our reserves will yield more than $37 billion in financial year 2020. The government has put aside 50% of it, that's $18.6 billion, for the 2020 budget. And there's still at least another $18.6 billion left of the investment returns from our reserves. And note, this is not the reserves itself, which are available for use without touching the principal sum of the reserves. It is like using only the interest income from our fixed deposit without touching the principal sum of the fixed deposit. Now, the amount of $2.8 billion for the uh, funds for the seniors can easily come from the balance of at least $18.6 billion, as it represents only 15% of that. There would still be a net balance investment income of $15.8 billion, which can be used to fund the $2 billion retrenchment benefit scheme, as well as the suspension of GST, which is $11 billion in 2020. The total sum of these two initiatives plus the GST suspension is $13.3 billion, which is below the unused net balance investment income of $18.6 billion. 